Hello, it's Jason Payne from Cool Banker, Dean Hop Realtors. Well, today I'm with the beautiful community of Veramindi in New Braunfels, Texas. First off, apologize for my voice. It's been messed up for about a month now. That's why you haven't seen a lot of videos from me. But we're in Veramindi, New Braunfels, Texas, and we're gonna do some videos, some Coventry spec homes, because I have a client in Italy who this might be a great fit for. So the one I'm gonna do video behind me right now is the Dean Plan. It is 2944 square feet, four bedroom, three and a half bath. Asking price is right at 500,000. Let's go check it out. Lots of space in this home. I really do love Veramindi as a community. The location, uh, right, easy access to everything in downtown New Braunfels. Landa Park is literally on the other side of 337. And if you haven't seen my motorcycle tour of this community, I will put that up in the uh, corner up here. You probably can see it now. But Coventry is one of the newer builders in this community and uh, they definitely build a really nice home. And I'm excited to show this one off to my client to see if it's gonna be a good fit for them. All right, let's head on inside. And if you've been watching my videos for a while, you know this is the time where I ask you to hit that like button because it really helps a lot. Right when you come in, you can tell the really nice hard, uh, engineered hardwood floors could be laminate, but it's hard to tell. They do such a good job. You do have an office right up front. It's one of the requirements for my clients. So this is a good size office. This is such a good time of the year to buy some spec homes. Things are picking up in Texas a little bit. There was a couple of homes that I thought might be a good fit for my client, but it's like, man, they're getting gobbled up. Uh, builders do not like sitting on spec homes. Spec homes means a home that the builders picked out everything in it built it once they're completed oh crap there's the toilet seat i thought i got them all this is the powder room downstairs um but builders hate sitting on completed homes so it's a really good deal to be able to get one of these because there's still room to negotiate all right coming into the kitchen in the main living space lots of room in here I'm gonna show off the uh, laundry room real quick. And then it does have the two car garage and two water heaters and plumb for water softener. No garage door opener, but that's something you could always put in yourself. And I'm a big fan of Chamberlain as far as garage door openers. This is a gas community, so uh, Coventry uses Whirlpool appliances, like the simple but elegant backsplash. Kind of your standard corner pantry. Spot for your refrigerator. And love the single basin granite composite sink in white. Very elegant, throw some olive oil in there to help repel some of the water. But it's got the pendulant lighting, really nice. Got your microwave oven at an easy access height, and then your Whirlpool pull stove there, or oven, sorry. This is gonna be kind of your space for your formal dining room, if you notice the two lights right there. So you put your dining room table right in this location, adjacent to the island. And then this is your living space. Because it's a two-story house, they've got the living the ceiling way up high, really creating a nice use of space. Sorry, spam risk is calling me again. We get that off. All right, lots of nice lighting. Now, this is gonna be up to my client, whether or not they like what they're seeing right now. <clears throat> One of my knocks on Veramindi is a lot of the houses are backed up back to back to each other. So finding green space lots are really difficult. This definitely is not a true green space lot because you see there are luxury apartments that are gonna be built right there, kind of behind them, but they're not right, right on top of you. So uh, other than that, it's a pretty good sized yard. Uh, the reason the mulch is there is because we've been kind of in a drought the last two years in New Braunfels temporarily had put in a restrictions for how much sod you could put in. That's why you got the uh, mulch. It is got sprinkler systems, uh, brick all the way around, good size covered patio. 
these are going to be blocked for ceiling fans if you wanted to put that in but lots of space out here good size backyard you can really do whatever you want to with this backyard or even extend this patio if you need a little more uh entertainment space but it's kind of nice having that brick wall behind you though all right let's head on back inside and check out the upstairs Oh yeah, we're gonna end up with a master bedroom right back there at the end, so stay tuned. Gotta give a little teaser, so uh, you watch the whole video. All right, we do have a really nice loft play area. So lots of different activities you could do up here. Give you a little view from the top. There you go. Once again, apologize for my voice. I've been dealing with this for a month now. All right, all the secondary bedrooms are upstairs. Good sized bedrooms. Once again, you can put your own ceiling fan in, but this is gonna have its own full bath. Very nicely done. Little peek down at the front door there. <clears throat> this is going to be kind of your shared bathroom. The other one upstairs. Kind of similar to the first one we just looked at. Another bedroom. A little bit smaller of a bedroom compared to the first one. because you gotta make room for this bedroom. And let me check out the closet. Sorry, I haven't been opening up these closets. There you go. Nothing fancy, it's just kind of your standard closet. Let me go see uh, the closet in the first bedroom because it's a little bit of bigger of a bedroom. So let's see if it's got a little bigger of a closet. Oh, the closet's gonna be in the bathroom. That's why I didn't see it. There we go. So it's gonna be a little bit of a mini walk-in closet and a little linen closet up here. That's kind of nice. And I'm gonna put the uh, floor plan layout at the end of this video. All right, that's the three bedrooms and the bathroom with the loft upstairs let's head on back downstairs all right back downstairs let's head into the master bedroom we'll finish up this video pretty good size master bedroom I like that it's got a little bit of a bump out there and then the master bath big giant soaking tub uh dual his and her vanities. Water closet with the seat down. And here's, we got two closets here. All right, here's one of the master bedroom closets, a really long one, place for the shoes. And then on the other side of the bathroom. So this is really cool having the two separate closets. And this one's gonna have its own shoe rack. Or in case if I was using it, that's my boot rack because I like to wear my cowboy boots. All right, and it's got this free standing shower right there. All right, pretty nice. And like I said, as of mid-January, oh, what else was the Ecobee thermostat? Big fan of those, I have one in my house. As of mid-January, they are asking, I think, $4.99 for it, but that's always negotiable because, like I said before, builders want to get these unit, these completed homes moved. All right, that's going to do it for the Dean Plan built by Coventry Homes in Veramindi Community, New Braunfels, Texas. Like I said, good builder, great community, and a fantastic location. If you're looking for a real estate agent that does these videos, please feel free to send me a text. My contact information will be in the description box 
Once again, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel. If you know anybody wanting to move to the New Braunfels, Bernie, Bovardi, or even Shirt Cibolo, please have them share this video with them. I'll be happy to help. All right, talk to you soon. Take care now. Bye.